Hi everyone, this is Ashwath and you are watching another YouTube channel and today we are going to learn how to create RSS feeds. So let's get started. And if you have not yet subscribed, hit the subscribe button and also hit the notification bell icon so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. I'll get inside my app, I'll create a new file say feeds.py and inside we will write from django.contrib.syndication.views import feed and we will say from django.template.default filters import truncate words we will also say from django dot urls import reverse lazy we will say from dot models import post so see this feed is required there because we are going to inherit from this truncate word is a filter that will see why we are going to use it Reverse lazy is just a lazy version of a reverse method that we have used and uh, we have to use the post because from the post model we have to retrieve the posts. Okay. Now we will say class latest post feed and that will inherit from feed and now we will say title is my super blog and we will say link equals to reverse lazy and from where we have to retrieve the url we have to retrieve the url from the post list view so for this we will say my app uh, and what was uh, the name for that view it was list view so it's list view and now we will say description description equals to new post and we will define items that will be connected with self and we will say return post dot new manager remember new manager is uh, our published manager that means uh, there is models.py in models.py we have defined a new manager that is a published manager that will retrieve only those posts that are already published okay great so we will say dot new manager dot all and we will retrieve five top post and then we will say df item underscore title will provide self and uh, item and that item will return the title so we'll say item dot title and we will say item underscore description and we will say self and item that will return item dot description okay save this and now what we will do we will just go to urls.py and inside urls.py we will say path feed to where to this view and from where we have to get it we will say from dot feeds import latest post feed and we will say latest post feed and the name is latest feed okay save this and i will just run the server python manage.py run server now just copy this link go to slash list and uh, we can also go to slash feed now it says post object has no attribute description 
because it should be body so I'll save this refresh so right here you can see we have our feeds since I am in my guest browser so I cannot access my extension so I'll just uh, get back inside my general browser and go right here and now I'll just refresh so right here you can see this is a feed and we have title of my super blog link and these three latest posts but see these are not latest posts these are old posts so why such thing is happening because we have not given a class meta ordering equals to created time what it means just get back inside the models.py add a class class meta say ordering equals to minus created okay save this and again i will just refresh and now you can see the latest post in the feed now you may be thinking that why we have used this truncate word see we have used truncate word because for description we just want to truncate the statement to let's say 30 or 25 words so for this what we will say we will just put that here we will say truncate word we will say up to 30 save this and now uh, actually I should go here refresh okay now I will go to here I will be redirected to the post that I want to read I have this post or whatever post you want you can just that or you can just subscribe to this so that's all about how to create feeds in the next lecture we will learn how to create search functionality Thank you. See you in the next one.